Mormonism is a cult. If you try to leave, you can get demoted at work, and you can have the entire California State University campus after you, to ensure you die a natural death, and come after you again and again to murder you when it doesn't work. You tried to leave Mormonism, and your Mormon parents put a hit out on you. After all, you are only a mundane. What is a mundane? Someone who does not know how to attack others through hypnotism, and does not know how to use other reprehensible methods of dominating and controlling others in secret. Hypnotism is everywhere. You've been hypnotized. There's a science out there that has nothing to do with God. It's the science of the mind. Witches use it. Mormons use it. Telepaths use it. Doctors, lawyers, psychiatrists, law enforcement, and educators are trained in the science of the mind. They use it to enforce their authority. If you don't know this, you've been classified a mundane, and you are the slave class. Mormons have built an entire church on beliefs that they can become a god by dominating others, through hypnotism, and various despicable forms of manipulation and control, taught to them by Lucifer in the LDS Temple. The Book of Mormon even claims that evil is necessary, to provide opposition in all things, and creation is void without it. What? Really? What? That's not what Genesis, chapter 1 says. Genesis says all things were created good, created good, not evil, and the Bible tells us to stay away from evil, Mormons thrive on evil, they excuse it, and twist everything around, saying evil is good, good alone, all by itself, is evil, they say, you need evil, or nothing is good, this is completely twisted, no one would be going to such lengths to excuse evil unless they were practicing it, and practicing it wholesale, 2 Nephi, chapter 2, verses 11 through 15, say, for it must needs be, that there is an opposition in all things, if not so righteousness could not be brought to pass, neither wickedness, neither holiness nor misery, neither good nor bad, wherefore, all things must needs be a compound in one, wherefore, if it should be one body it must needs remain as dead, having no life neither death, nor corruption nor incorruption, happiness nor misery, neither sense nor insensibility, wherefore, it must needs have been created for a thing of naught, wherefore there would have been no purpose in the end of its creation, and in fine, all things which are created, it must needs be that there was an opposition, even the forbidden fruit in opposition to the tree of life, the one being sweet and the other bitter, consider this, the Book of Mormon says that there is no purpose to creation without evil, can you imagine, who would say that, only the devil, demonic teachings are everywhere, reinforcing Mormonism in every other form of oppression, learn some basic self-defense, don't eat meat, respect all life, remain sexually pure, stay in the word of God, God's laws rule everything, and secret societies are using spiritual law against you, get your Bible out, use it, God's word says, arise, Jerusalem, and shine like the sun, the glory of the Lord is shining on you, other nations will be covered by darkness, but on you, the light of the Lord will shine, people will tell the good news of what the Lord has done, you will no longer be forsaken and hated, you will know that I, the Lord, have saved you, that the mighty God of Israel sets you free, no longer will the sun be your light by day, or the moon be your light by night, I the Lord, will be your eternal light, the light of my glory will shine on you, Lucifer, is here, in real life, this is the end of the 1000 years tribulation, and Lucifer is still here, hiding, in California, in academia, in a state university, posing as a geneticist and releasing COVID in public places, making the world a living hell, he is a killer, I have the mind of Christ, I cast you out, you unclean spirits, in the name of Jesus, unclean spirits, come out, in the name of Jesus, out, Satan, you old Leviathan, I cast you out, in the name of Jesus, out, now, in the name of Jesus, mind wipes cancelled, mind wipes cancelled, I have the mind of Christ, mind blocks reversed, the hidden things are shouted from the housetops, 